All right, now from this screen, you know, like I said, look, you're gonna go. I call it Kex crap because you'll understand why. Go to your whatever you called it, your clam chowder, whatever food dish tickles your fancy, I suppose. And we're gonna wait for this to load. And you're gonna see the sodal spinning bar. That's your friend because that means it's working, and you're always gonna love that. So, be back in a second. It's unloading. All right, so then you're brought to this screen, and oh man, the mouse is really slow. Doesn't have my preferences on it yet. Wait, I got a text from my cousin. Oh yeah, look at this. Yeah, it's the welcome screen. This is welcome like 30,000 different languages. Be used to it. You'll like it. Uh, yeah, I'll come back when this is done. It's your sound effects. My speakers are off. All right, welcome to this screen. Okay, before you begin, okay, now you're going to press Z forward slash, basically because Z is to the right of shift and forward slash is to the left of shift, and unless you have another kind of keyboard or you just, you Dvorak or something, if you have Mac keyboard, just shut up, okay. So, and you're going to say uh, US, US, and then after that you're going to say US, uh, unless you don't live in the US or you like some other kind of preferences there. I personally don't give a crap. I'm going to go through all this, even the very basic stuff, just so no one gets confused. Because I hate it whenever I was confused. I don't want any of you people to be confused. I'll over-explain. Uh, do not transfer my information. No, stop texting me, Jimmy. It's my cousin. Uh, do not transfer my information now. Uh, you don't want that, because that's dumb. You might, but if you did, that means you wouldn't be watching this. Okay, uh, my computer is not connected to the internet. You want to select that, and then click continue. And then now you're going to type in all your information. I'll be right back. Alright, then you push continue. Make sure all your information is accurate because Macs are supposed to be pretty and you want it to be pretty with your information. Jimmy, geez, hello. Okay, I'm at home. I do film and video because I can. Alright, uncheck this. Jeez, like what do you want from me? But yeah, okay, don't stay in touch. That's dumb. Continue and then just put in your account information. Mine's just going to be my name, password's going to be Y, verify Y, hint is going to be yes. Y stands for yes, because it asks you for your password every single time you want to install something. So I just put yes, Y, 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 that's what I do, Y for yes, because why even bother having a password on a Mac? Like seriously, I'd rather ha I'd be worried about someone stealing my Mac, not getting into it. Anyone can get into a Mac without a password, it's easy. Anyways, uh, so yeah, it's Y. So everyone do why, don't do anything else, I mean you can, I'm being retarded, but don't do anything else because anything else is stupid. Continue. It's creating your account. Okay, you're gonna... Oh my goodness! Register later. Continue. Because you don't want to... Just don't even worry about it. Look, time zones. You're going to select your time zone. And you're going to select the time. Oh yeah! You see that? You see what time and date it is right now? Yeah. I have church in the morning, man. <laughs> I'm tired. But okay, uh, continue. Enjoy your Apple computer, yay! And you're like, man, I'm super excited for this part. I'm gonna go create. Whoa, why did the gra D decide later? If it asks you that. Oh, dude, whoa, why did the graphics suck? Oh man, don't freak out. Really, don't freak out. It'll get better. Okay, that's whatever. Okay, now first go to dock, turn magnification on, and turn turn hiding on because that's what you're supposed to do. And this, I'm just being nitpicky. I'm really weird about this. Don't, don't even judge me. Put that right there, and then change the size down a little bit. You can also change the size by hitching this little buddy right here. All right, uh, a little, little more, more. Uh, right there. That's the Mac that we're looking for. There. Okay. Okay. Now I was kidding about this, but what you do want to do is you want to go to keyboard, and you're gonna want to make. Well, why'd I do that? You're going to want to go to Modifier Keys and make Option Command and make Command Option. Press OK. So this way, when you want to do things like, like, ooh, Alt, Tab. Look, like on a PC and like a Mac, it's in the same position. And Alt, Q. So that's how you do commands now, is you use Alt, same place as Command is on a Mac. If you're used to a PC, you'll be like, oh man, I'm not used to this, this is so complicated. But it's actually easier to get used to this than it is to get used to the other way around, because it's just better for your fingers if you're a human, and I assume you're all humans. Anyways, uh, in the link, or in the links, the description below, be a list of things you need to download. 
I have them on a flash drive. You're going to need probably a 2 gig flash drive. Uh, you will need at least a 2 gig flash drive actually. Um, or a disk. That, that's stupid. Just get a 2 gig. Buy a 2 gig flash drive. You lazy people. Um, some of the things I said to download, you're going to need the Mac OS X combo update. I just throw this ever so meticulously on my desktop. Uh, Camara, Multi Beast, 3.10.1, Snow Leopard Edition. You're going to want X Move. You're going to want Update Helper. And that's that's about it for now. Uh, that's good. And then, uh, yeah, be back when this is done uh, putting it on my desktop. Oh wow, I wasn't even paying attention. I was texting my cousin Jimmy. Now as you can see, I'm gonna clean this up. Bam! Yes, love you, Mac. Okay, uh, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... No, hey, you know what? I'm gonna put these in a... Third place is eject that, because I, I don't want that. This can be up here. That, can that even go there? Or will that correct itself? Let's, let's find out. Oh, uh, yep, it can not go there. So we'll just... There we go. Okay. So there, you're on your desktop. And you're like, man, what the heck is going on? Now, for one, you're gonna want to make sure you have an Ethernet cable plugged in for this. If you don't, if you didn't download the update, you can easily just later go into software update do it for you. Don't do this yet. Don't do anything unless I tell you. If you do anything wrong, the whole thing will blow up. Hyperbole, but it, it's not good. I've done this like 70 times. Don't, don't even. It, you will hate it because I've hated it. Go to system. Pro Why did I double click? Super reflexes. Okay. But a network, oh look, it's red. That means you don't have network. Network is the biggest pain in the butt you'll ever meet. Okay, unarchive multi beast. Mac put it on top of itself because it's dumb. Okay, now you're going to go into multi beast. See that little tomato? Click on that little guy. Continue, continue. Okay, go back. I'm going to show you this. See these? It, for the people who read and don't just put continue like I do, this is a list of things to do. Do not follow this list. Um, Tony Mac actually updated this list and said, oh, what you should do, which is what I'm going to be telling you uh, what to do. And, uh, oh, yeah, uh, this is bad. Don't ever do this. But Tony Mac, good stuff. Uh, to download things like MultiBeast, you're going to actually need to make an account. Oh, no, someone has my email address. Big deal. It's free. Whatever. Just do it. And Tony Mac makes some awesome stuff. Sorry. Tired. Makes some pretty awesome stuff, and I trust all of his things because they've worked for me, and they're great. Now, continue, continue, and then agree. This is what you're going to do. You're going to select your nacho cheese, whatever. This is what you're going to check off. I'm going to pause for a second. Hang on. All right. Here's what you're going to want to do. Ooh, why'd that turn? Turn in the viewfinder. My bad. Okay. Here's what you're going to want to do. Do exactly what I say. Don't ask why. If you want to read the descriptions, you can read descriptions. But just don't even. Just do what I tell you. If you got if you have all the components I have. And if you, if you don't, turn this video off, literally. There's no point to watch this if you don't have my exact components. Other than the ones I say are, that you can have different ones, like... The ones that are... S In the description, there will be components. Next to it, they will say if they're, you need those ones or not. Just... Whatever. Do what I say. Okay. You're going to check Easy Beast Install. Okay. You're going to check System Utilities. Now you're going to open Drivers and Bootloaders. Then you're going to open... Hex and enablers, and we're gonna do this one first. We'll skip to the bottom of the network. You know why? I hate this. This one works, and this one works. But you can't you can't just do this. You can't just do this. You can't do both. You have to install this, reboot, install this, reboot, install this, reboot, over and over again until it eventually works. It's a pain in the butt. So here's basically what I want you to do, because I've done this and it works uh, most of the time. You're gonna install this one, okay? I mean, it, it'll always work, but sometimes it'll just take longer, okay? Install that one. You're good. The top one, the one that says. LNX to Max Real Tech nonsense. I am tired of people texting me right now unless they're. Well, that's my cousin Jimmy again twice. Uh, okay, talking about women. There's a shock. Okay, disrespectful little boy. Okay, we're gonna go to audio, then you're gonna go to Universal, then we're gonna go to Voodoo HDA 0.2.56. Now you're like, man, why do you skip from you know network to audio? Like, you know why? Because these two are the biggest pain. If you don't do these two exactly as I tell you, exactly right, just give up. Just no more, no more Mac for you. Okay, go to disk, top one, I O A H C I block, bullcrap, storage injector. I don't give a rat's furry little butt. Now you're done with the drivers. 
go on to customizations, go to boot options, go to the first one, 32-bit Apple boot screen. You're like, oh, but I have a 64-bit, shut up, I don't care. System definitions, Mac Pro, Mac Pro 3 comma 1, there you go, there's your system definition. Theme, Tony Mac X 86 Remix. No, oh, but I kind of like the, all right, shut up, shut up, you, you like this one, period. Jeez, just do that, because that one's the best, especially for dual booting. Okay, then you're going to check this, you want all that. In the end, it should come out to 12.6 megabytes. If you don't have 12.6 megabytes, you did something wrong, and redo it, watch the video again, I don't care. Just, whatever, continue, and can install, and then now you're going to have to type in your long password, like that, because, man, that was, it was so hard, having to type all that in. Aren't you happy you did that and just only had to have one letter? Because you're going to have to type that a lot of times, especially during this tutorial. Unless you didn't do what I said. And, oh man, you're going to be typing that password forever. But, uh, yeah, I'm just going to... I'll be back when this is done uh, loading. It might take a little bit of, a little bit of time. Oh, a little while. It's not too bad, though. All right, be right back.